Hi everyone. In this video, we will guide you through the new eDispatches portal. Once you log into your eDispatches account, you will immediately notice that the portal has a whole new facelift. The eDispatches subscribers that receive audio alerts, you will automatically be taken to the dashboard menu. That's this menu. We have placed the recent activity right on the dashboard for your convenience. You can listen to recent alerts or listen to live streaming right from the dashboard. Your eDispatches equipment is also located at the top right. If there are any issues with the status of the detector, it will be displayed here. The recipient page will display all members in the account. You can add or remove members from this page either by selecting new for a new member or selecting the member and editing their information. We have also added a search feature so you can search for a member quicker. The messaging page is where you can send a priority text message to all members or a group of members. This feature is included with your eDispatches plan. You can send a message to all the members by selecting a check mark and selecting all. You can also individually unselect some members. The message has been successfully sent. You can also create new groups by selecting Manage Groups. Select Add Group to create a new group and select Create to create it. Once your group has been created, you can select individual members that you would like in that group. You can also delete groups from the Manage Groups menu as well. Once created, you can go back to messaging and your group will be available in the list. Priority Blast subscribers can generate a code right from this page. To send a voice message, select the Voice tab. You can select Generate, which will automatically generate a phone number, code, and a PIN number to send out the voice message. Follow the instructions to send out the Priority Blast message. If you do not have Priority Blast and you would like to add this feature, please contact our sales department. Priority Text Messaging and Priority Blast are both available in our iPhone and Android eDispatches app. One major improvement we have designed in the new portal was an account page. You can select the account right from the top right of the page. The first tab is our Plans tab. The Plans tab will provide details on the activity and plan usage. If your account is ever over or near its usage, Please contact our sales department to learn how to upgrade your account. The Detectors tab will display information about your eDispatches equipment. If you have more than one set of eDispatches equipment, it will also be displayed here on the left side. If you have more than one set of equipment, it is suggested to name your equipment. You can name it or set a nickname to it by selecting the pencil and naming, putting a name right in the field and selecting the check mark when done. You can also assign different trouble contacts for the equipment. This is a great feature if your equipment ever loses power or internet. These recipients will be automatically notified. The Tones tab contains all tones under the account. If you have more than one set of tone, they will also be displayed on the left panel. If alerts are not older than 24 hours, you will be able to still listen to them. The Users tab allows master users the ability to add additional users to manage the account or manage subaccounts. Subaccounts tab is where subaccounts can be managed. Large agencies may use subaccounts to manage multiple departments or agencies underneath the same account. 
Master users will see all five tabs displayed in their account. That's plan, detectors, tones, users, and sub-accounts. If you are not a master user, you will only see detectors and tones. This concludes our new portal guide. If you have any questions or issues, please contact us. We thank you for being a loyal eDispatcher subscriber.